Well, let's talk about India now, which has confirmed its third case of coronavirus in the southern state of Kerala, leading Kerala to declare a state of emergency. This, uh, the south Indian state of Karnataka is also observing 63 travellers who have recently come from, uh, well, coronavirus-affected countries. Among them, 58 people have been put under isolation at home and one person is, has been admitted to an isolation ward in a hospital. 56 samples have now been sent for testing and out of which 39 have confirmed negative. This comes after Prime Minister Narendra Modi also put together a group of ministers to review the country's preparedness to fight the disease. The Principal Secretary to the Prime Minister reviewed the situation and the arrangements which have been made for the approximately 600 evacuees from Wuhan. The group of ministers comprises of the Union Health Minister Harshvardhan, Civil Aviation Minister Hardeep Singh Puri, the External Affairs Minister S.J. Shankar, among others. India has also revised its travel advisory, urging people to refrain from traveling to China. Anyone with a travel history to China after, the, after January 15th of this year could be quarantined. E-visa facilities for Chinese passport holders has also been suspended for now. E-visas, which have already been issued to Chinese nationals, have also been made invalid as of now. The facility for submitting the online application the physical visa for China has been suspended. People with compelling reasons to visit India are advised to contact the Indian Embassy in Beijing. Instructions to comply with the new travel advisory have been issued to all national and international airlines operating from China. 645 people who have been evacuated from Wuhan are now in two quarantine centers. Uh, the centers are being maintained by the armed forces and the Indo-Tibetan border police. All evacuees are being medically examined on a daily basis. And Sidan Sibal uh, sent us more updates on coronavirus spread in India. Uh, India uh, launched a 96-hour operation over the weekend to get back these people. They have been kept in two quarantine facilities. One is uh, the Manesar facility, which has been formed by the Indian Army. Another is the ITBP's uh, facility near Chavla camp. Uh, there were a few cases, uh, five people. Uh, it looked they had symptoms, but... Um, we have been confirmed by the Indian Army sources uh, that there is no case of uh, the virus. We know that these people will be kept in quarantine for a period of 14 days. But by and large, a big concern here in India as well. Uh, this virus, of course, we know has killed many people in China and India is taking all the measures it can so that this virus does not spread to uh, the entire country.